politics and in Kirinyaga County, the governor, Anwar Igoro, has given the strongest hint just yet as she may quit the Jubilee Party for the United Democratic Alliance. Speaking in Moyawa, Igoro said she is keen on obeying the wishes of her constituents, even if it means gravitating towards the deputy president's camp. <laughs> Kirinyaga Governor Anwa Iguru now says she'll heed to the call of area residents to ditch the Jubilee Party and defend her seat on the United Democratic Alliance party ticket. Waiguru has been seen to be gravitating away from Jubilee following the defeat of the Building Bridges Initiative. Waiguru has in the meantime taken a swipe at Nat Kenya Party leader Martha Karua over the recent inroads into the cracks of Mount Kenya politics. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, Baringo Senator Gideon Moy now says the decision to front Kano's flag bearer in the 2022 general election will squarely be decided by the Kano National Delegates Conference scheduled for the 30th of September. Delegates were tied to Nairobi to Kutane. Na ni delegates ya chama chetu cha Kano ambao wataamua. Ile njia ambayo Kano itafuata kwa kura ya 2022. Kwa nasema Gideon atakimbia urais. Gideon afanyi Gideon. Mlisikia mambo mengi sio? Lakini ametulia tu amekimia na ngoja time. Speaking in Kwale County where he met over 300 Kanu delegates, Moi said at the moment Okoa Kenya partners are strengthening their respective parties ahead of the general election. For Prime Edition, I'm Gladys Mongai.